Hey everyone, I'm very excited to be presenting you a new four-part motivational talk series that'll address the various issues that musicians often have to deal with. Now most of this comes from my personal experiences, but I hope that my experiences will be able to help you and anyone else whom you might know deal with issues that are similar to this. Part one is Insecurity is something everyone has to deal with, no matter what field you're in. It's the negative feelings we unknowingly develop inside ourselves. Somewhere between the time when you were a kid and first discovering your instrument to when you became older and more serious, music suddenly became less fun and more of a chore, where even the thought of music has attached itself to a constant worry. Worrying about the future, worrying about if you're good enough. If only you could just stop caring, just for one moment. But that's not part of being a good musician, right? This constant necessity to sound good in front of your fellow students, to sound good in front of your teachers, for your parents, to sound good all the time. What happened to the music? Oh, and your emotions, they're so dependent on your playing. When you play well, things are okay. In fact, they're great. But come next week, when things don't go well, on your lesson or on stage, you feel useless, inadequate, where each time you open your case, you're greeted by an overwhelming sense of you're not good enough. To the point where it starts to affect who you are and how you live your life. It chips away at your confidence, all because you can't separate the musician you from the you you. On the stage, it can turn into a paralyzing fear which grips you. What happened to all those hours of practice? What caused you to be so scared that you had a blackout moment in front of all these people? And all of these awful experiences only cause you to doubt yourself more. Perhaps you shouldn't be a musician after all. Just give up. After all, you probably won't even make it. Okay, let's hit the pause button right there. All these voices in your head, they're the evil voices which feed upon your insecurity. Let's start by writing down a few of the things that affect you in a negative way. Here are some of mine from when I was younger. I'm scared of being judged by my fellow students. I'm scared no one will want to play chamber music with me. I'm scared my teacher will hate me. I'm scared I won't have a career one day. And now I want you to write yours down too and take a good long look at it. When you're ready to say goodbye to your fears, I want you to destroy them. Remember why you chose to play music. Remember the first time you touched an instrument, when the joy of discovery was far more important than making sure the notes were perfect. You're an artist. What you have to say musically is worth sharing because it brings people joy. You might not think so, but that's not your decision to make whether or not someone else loves what you do. Every time you feel the darkness, I want you to say this. I play music because I need to express my emotions. I am a communicator. The will of the composer lives on in me, and together, the weight of our emotions will inspire you. And just remember, music is all about accumulating as many special moments as possible. Those moments that draw us in and leave us breathless following along with every note that you play, those are the moments which stay with us for a very long time. But you're not alone. I believe in you.